I look like somebody's grandma. This is Terry Oh my God. We untouchable, uncrushable. We untouchable, uncrushable. <laughs> Welcome back to Dapper Diane. If this is your first time here, hi, my name is Dorothy. It is very nice to meet you. Um, if you could go ahead, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff, that'd be greatly appreciated. Um, and this week's video is going to be a little vloggy vlog leading up to my time selectomy. So today is Tuesday, March 6th. No, it's April. I'm tripping. April 6th. And then my time select me is tomorrow and I have a lot of stuff to do to prepare. So it's just going to be a little vloggy vlog of getting prepared. One, I got to clean my room because it's a little bit of a mess. I got to clean my kit, clean my house essentially before I leave out of here. Cause I don't want to come back to a dirty home. You know how us black folks, we got to clean our homes before we go somewhere so that we don't come back to a dirty home. So I got to do that. Um, I got to pack because I'm just going to stay at my mom's overnight and then come back probably Thursday so that she can monitor me at least for the first 24 hours to make sure I'm alive. Um, yeah, I got to pack some clothes just for a day and just for surgery. And I got to pack some food with me because I already bought food. I'm not going to buy food again. And last thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take myself out to eat for my last meal. I think I'm going to get some nachos and I think I'm going to go to Carolina L house to get those nachos. Um, just cause it's downtown and it's warm. It feels really good to me. Untouchable, uncrushable. We untouchable, Some of the food that I'm going to bring is this bacon or baked potato bacon soup, some chicken noodle soup, and some grits. And the last thing I'm going to bring is some Italian ice. So I'm going to put that in there. And only plan staying for a day the first 24 hours after so that should hold me over i should be asleep um i'm thinking my throat gonna be hurting so much that i probably won't even be worried about eating so that's that but i need to wash these dishes so we're gonna do that for a second i need to get a haircut oh my god but one thing that i'm really scared about is honestly surgery surgery as a whole scares me and i think for me it scares me even more than normal because i'm a full-grown adult who's never had a surgery before so i'm completely aware of what's about to happen like i'm about to be unconscious and i don't even mean it in like a derogatory way but like People are going to be doing things to my body while I am unconscious. And that's really scary. And I don't think anybody's out to get me or anything like that. But I also realized that like, well, you could die at any moment, but like this is surgery, bro. I'm going to be not unconscious under anesthesia. Anything can happen. I could wake up dead. Oh my God. Like. I'm just really scared because I know that, I mean, it's, it's just getting my tonsils removed. So it's not like a major complicated surgery. This is something that's very routine, but I just think about how like I could die <laughs> just a little bit, you know, I don't know, man, I'm bugging. <laughs>
but I'm back. I, what did I just do? I just showered, changed to this cute little outfit. This is what I'm gonna go downtown in and have my nachos in, but yeah, I just wanted to pick something simple. Um, I cleaned up everything that I need to clean up before I leave. So I'm going to, yeah, head over to my mom's side of town and then we're gonna go out. One, you can see how dirty my car is, but most importantly, I just parallel, par parallel park, y'all. I don't ever parallel park, and I did it on my first try. I'm proud of me. So I've made it to downtown, and this is the menu. I don't think, um, well, no, it's not I don't think. I know for sure I'm not eating inside. I'm waiting for outside seating. There are my nachos. They said it's gonna be about like a 30 minute, 35 minute wait for a table. And usually I'd be like, oh no, oh no baby, that's fine, you can keep that. But like I said, it's my last day or my last couple of hours eating regular food. So I'll just have patience and wait. Um, and honestly, it's warm, it's nice out. Um, I'm out on this rooftop by myself. Usually smokers would be out here, but I'm here by myself. So that's nice. Oh my god. 